good afternoon all and today I will be discussing my UU204 Matei activity. So for my Matei topic, I have selected natural heritage sites. And for a natural heritage site that I have selected, I have selected the Kimajoka sand dune. So today I will be basically showing the process I went through to create my Matei, my creative Matei, and um, all how it was all originally my work. And I'm going to show proof of originality today. So first, I'm just going to share my screen to show all my personal photographs. So for my Matei activity, I have selected photo collage. So I'm going to be using an application to create a photo collage using my own personal photograph. So all these six photographs I am showing you on my screen are photographs from two separate trips that I went on with my family. And these are photos from the sand dunes and you can clearly see pictures of pottery shards and the dunes itself. So therefore, these are my own personal photos and I will be further showing this is originality when I create the collage. I'm going to stop sharing that. And I'm going to share my screen in my application. Okay, so I am going to be using an application called Canva. So this application is would allow me to create my photo collages with ease. So I have downloaded this template and I'm going to edit it in a certain way that it makes it my own work. I am not simply using another person's collage. These reference photos, as you can see, I'm not going to be using those. I'm going to be replacing them with my own images. So I will do that now. First, I will get my photos and I will copy and paste my photos into the template and it will replace the reference photos that you can see in on the screen. So as you can see, this is my first photo that I'm putting up. I'm replacing it with the reference photo of the rollerblades. And it, you can see that it's really been put in well. The next photo I will be putting I'm going to continue that process with some more photos. I'm putting certain photos in, I'm putting certain photos in certain areas because I feel like they would look better within a certain area rather than another. Sorry.
Mm -hmm. As you can see, I have already put in a few of the photos. I'm just going to put the two remaining photos. Okay, so those are all the photos I am going to be using in my collage today. So before I move on to the next step, I'm just going to send these. I'm going to do that nicer. I'm expanding these photos so that they fit completely and that there are no edges showing. I'm going to be doing that with the remaining photos as well. Again, these are all my personal photographs. I have not downloaded them from the internet. These are personal photographs from a fam from two family trips rather that I went on to the dunes. And the proof of them being my original photos is that I am present within the photos along with my family members. Okay, so I have expanded that, and now I am going to do this one. Okay, so now that I've expanded that, I am going to remove all these little bits from the original template, such as the bits of the newspaper article, the daisies. And the word mood board. So over here, I'm going to replace that there. I'm going to duplicate this so that over here. You can replace that with 2022. And I have put those dates as those are the dates that I went to the sand dunes in between that time, between 2019 and 22. So these photos were taken in between that time. Okay. This case this again, as I want to add a, another word. Here. I'm going to add the word pottery shards. This is take this sunflower and I want it to be in the field. Well, 
actually, I'm going to move this one a bit more down. There we go. So I'm going to right now it looks okay to me, but I feel like I need to make some slight adjustments. So first I'm going to just make a few. Right now, I think my collage is okay. I'm just taking another look at it to see if it needs any more adjustments based on my liking. So, I think I'm going to move this a bit here. Look okay to me for now. So yeah. Okay, so I'm kind of liking the look of my clothes, so I'm gonna leave it as it is. So as you can see here, I'll put on the dates 2019, 2022, as that is when the photos were taken. And out over here I put the word for new shards just to, I understand that people can see that clearly there are body shots there, but I just want to make it clear that these body shots are what is found in the sand dunes and they're actually currently still being unearthed by the wind. Um, I've left the sunflowers and the little white flower that was in the original template as is because I did like the look of it and I feel like it works with my collage really nicely and it looks really nice. So that is my original work. 
I'm going to add. Okay, so that is my final collage of the Cindy Poker fan view. And I will be further giving a reflection on why the sand dunes itself is important and why we need to protect it. So I'm going to stop Okay, so that was my creative essay for U204 for semester two in 2022. So I do hope that those watching got a clear understanding that it's my original work and while I did use an application and a downloaded template to create the collage, I made my own personal changes to it so that there is proof of originality and that it was the, co the final collage itself was my thoughts and my ideas and my personal information. So thank you for listening and I'll be ending my recording there. Oh, thank you.